Tonight, history comes alive. The Fish Preserve is a boat shop where volunteers meet weekly with the purpose of bringing back a piece of history one boat at a time. As it ends, Melissa Warren tells us tonight why they call their hobby a labor of love. If you wanted to learn boat building, this would be the place to come because every boat they do is done like they, it was built in the first place. They, they have some fancy tools, but most everything is hand done. Rick Stewart first touched a toolbox in his grandfather's shop. Now he wants to pass on the hobby of boat building to anyone willing to learn. I am going to give back to the youth uh, the things that I've learned that were taught to me and the things that I've learned over the years in this career. Um, this is a dying art. Right now, Stewart is working with some new volunteers, sharing the basics of restoration using recycled wood. Kind of stepping out of my box because I've always worked with metal and steel, and this is all mostly wood type of working in, in, in the old way of doing things. Do you think it's really intriguing? I have an interest in at least checking it out and finding out how everything works. Stewart says anyone can learn. Yes, if I can do it, anybody can do it. You know, I mean, it's really easy. It's not really that hard. Now, when they say anyone can do this, I decided to take that as a challenge and try it out myself. And I'm both done the work. Stewart calls this project a labor of love because it's an experience that should be shared. Boat building is not a mechanical science. It is something that uh, comes from the heart. In Cortez Village, Melissa Warren, SNN, the Suncoast News Network. Well, Fish Boat Works volunteers typically work on the boats Thursdays, Fridays, and Saturdays, and they're always looking for new volunteers and even boat donations.